Hey guys, it's Ashley, and welcome back to my channel. Hello to my subscribers, my patrons, my super thinkers. Welcome back. If you're new here, hello, welcome, subscribe. Just so you guys know, still sick, still have bronchitis, still blowing my nose like a demon, still sound like shit. Celebrating Britney today. Her book came out yesterday, so I figured why not wear my Britney shirt in support of Miss Britney Spears. The only thing is, is my book was shipped to my sister's house because, you know, she gets those indigo points. So I don't know when I'm going to see my sister next, probably in like a week or so, maybe two weeks because she lives far. So I'm just going to have to read my book at another time. Okay. Enough about Brittany. Let's talk about Ray. So I pretty much started my channel back up when Ray released her 21st Century Blues album. Um, I was doing a couple of videos before then, but that was the like full first like full album review I've done in like years. <laughs> and it literally just blew up my channel, which was insane. It was the first time I've ever heard of Ray. I didn't know her previous songs. To be fair, I did know the songs. I just didn't know it was her. Uh, obviously, they were like remix songs, like dance songs with like David Guetta and shit like that. Um, and I fell in love with her. Like her voice was spectacular. I was absolutely blown away. Like absolutely blown away by this album. I can't believe how congested I am. My nose is so red too. Oh, anyways, I'm going to stop bitching. So... Yeah, I learned about Ray. I decided to go see her live performance in Toronto. It was at a very tiny, not tiny venue, but a small venue. Uh, the last show she did here a couple weeks ago um, during Thanksgiving weekend, it was a bigger venue, but I didn't go because uh, I actually sold my tickets because I was like, I should go spend my time with my family. Uh, and they sold hours before the show. So I was like, I was gonna go to the show but then they sold and I was like okay I'm gonna drive up to my mom's and spend the weekend with my family so it didn't work out but that's okay I got to see her live once it was amazing if you're interested I do have a concert review on this channel if you want to check that out it's under my Ray playlist as well as my concert review and reaction playlist so I've made the conscious decision to not react to the audio album of her 21st century blues symphonic choir thing at the Royal Albert Hall. I just have a feeling I'm going to react to the whole audio and she's going to come out with all the videos and I'm going to be heartbroken because I'm not going to do it twice. So for now, I am going to react to the one video she did release. I'm going to wait a couple months, maybe, and maybe the end, maybe the new year. If nothing comes out or she doesn't mention it's coming out, I'll do the rest of the audio. I'm actually going to go months without hearing this audio, which is crazy. Ruger, shut up. <laughs> okay, let's get through this. I'm so sorry I'm sniffling. I'm so sorry I'm all gross. I know I should stop making videos, but it's literally the one thing that brings me joy. And plus, like, otherwise I'd be listening to this music without you guys. And who wants that? I'm very curious to see what order this came in and i'm sure she does it in the order of the album so i'm just gonna double check intro oscar winning tears hard out here the thrill is gone five star hotels etc etc so definitely the first song she would have been singing so i'm very excited so the intro happened and then this happened so who knows maybe the intro is included in this video i have no idea let's get into it Oh my god. Oh my god, it sounds so good. I gotta put this down. <gasps> it sounds like a Disney movie. I have chills everywhere. I'm sorry, I'm gonna restart this because I'm just in fucking shock, but how can you guys want me to react to the audio when the visual of this symphony is just stunning? My stomach just growled. Oh my God, okay, okay, I gotta fix my headphones. We're starting again. Turning it up. Oh my 
god, this must be a fucking dream for her. I would die. I would die if my elbow was turned into this. Is irrelevant, height is irrelevant. He was a one out of ten. I wish that I knew it then. I'm still recovering. Oh, I'm truly unfarmable. I love a sentiment. Quickly, I open up. I learned my lesson then. Thought I was safe again. Thought he was innocent. I was so wrong. I can't deny I was stuck in a daze. A terrible face. You was convincing, though. Very believable. The role that you play. So I'll take this front row. Tragedy, it didn't have to be. Look how you talk to me, cursing and blasphemy, cinematography. Get this on camera, please. Oh no, I'm gonna believe this. And no, I can't deny. I thought you were the man, you were the plan. What you lying for? You crying for? You did it again. can't. Ugh, I need a second. Guys. Oh my god, I'm such a fucking emotional wreck these days. Everything sets me off. Everything sets me off. Believe how red my nose is. Whatever. That made me so emotional because I know her dreams are coming true. Like, She has always wanted to release her album the way she wanted to do it with the amount of genres she wanted to put on it with no restrictions or anything. I am so sorry. I sound like shit. Um, And it's just obviously this is a dream for her to have a full orchestra and a choir, a fucking symphony. 
just backing her up on her life's work is just sickening. Like, I that would have been my dream. If I had an album and I could say, hey, I would love to have a symphony behind it and a choir, that would be my dream because music sounds so different. It doesn't matter what genre of music you have. Evanescence has done this. Hanson has done this. Like, so many artists, like, it doesn't matter what genre they're in. So many artists have done this whole symphony thing, and it just changes the music in the best possible way, but uh, it doesn't take away the goodness from the original. I am just so proud of her. I'm just here for the ride as a fan to watch her dreams come true, and hearing her album for the first time, I was blown away. Like, I don't think I've had a reaction since then, like a full album reaction where I've never heard the artist before and I've just been completely blown away by every single song. I don't think that's going to ever happen again, to be honest. Uh, so yeah, again, I'm, I'm just a fan. I'm here for the ride. I'm so proud of her. I'm not going to listen to this album until she releases all these videos because I want to react to every single video of this show. God, if I had the money, I would have flown to England and been at the show. I don't even care if I was in the nosebleeds. I really would have loved to have seen this because it was a one night only show. Unfortunately, she's not going to tour like this, but wow. I just honestly can't wait to hear all of this. So girl, you better release these videos or a DVD. I don't give a shit. I need to watch the whole thing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please go check out my original reaction to Ray's 21st Century Blues album. I think you'll really enjoy it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, to like, to comment, to turn your notifications on. If you're a Ray fan, please come back. I love doing Ray reactions. I'm completely obsessed with her and I think she is just superb. I just did a reaction of her song with Stormzy and I'm obsessed with that song. It is such a banger. Uh, you can also join me on Discord if you want to chat about Ray with me. It's uh, in the description if you want to get the link. And yeah, if you want to follow me on Instagram, on TikTok, and obviously if you want to support my channel, you can head over to patreon.com. Thank you guys so much for watching. I don't have a vinyl of the day. That's so sad. I was wondering why it looks so silly back there, and I can tell you exactly why. Um, I had a printer jam, so my printer is right here. I had a paper jam. And I had to get, take everything off and I forgot to put stuff back on. So, uno momento. Now, how fitting is that? Come on, it's a Britney day. This painting someone drew for me, I'm obsessed to this day. I, I don't know if I want to move it because I do have my Femme Fatale book, tour book, signed by Britney Spears right above it and you guys can't see it. I might switch it out and see how that works. Um, but yeah, blackout. Do I have to say more? It's Britney Spears Blackout. Go listen to it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.